Hello everybody, today I'm releasing my second point of my 10 point action plan. My second point is technology water, which is taking water from the ocean and turning it into a fresh drinking water. There are 150 countries around the world that takes water from the ocean and turns it into a fresh drinking water. They produce 18 billion gallons of fresh drinking water per day and serves over 70 million people. Some of these countries produce enough water for their people and sell it to the other countries, while California is struggling for water with the ocean at our doorstep. People here in California have had enough with a drought and water shortage that leads to dry grass, dry bushes, and dead trees that causes wildfires. In Southern California, San Diego has one of the largest desolation facilities in the nation. As your next governor, I will double the facility that currently produces 50 million gallons of fresh drinking water per day and serves over 400,000 local residents. The good thing is, they can be powered by wind or solar energy. I will also build a desolation plant in Huntington Beach that will produce 50 million gallons of fresh drinking water per day and upgrade the Santa Barbara desolation plant that will produce 3 million gallons of fresh drinking water per day or 25 to 30 percent of the city's demand. We have to make sure that all desolation plants use clean energy, do not harm the ocean, or marine lives. If 150 countries around the world depend on technology water, why can't California with the Pacific Ocean at our doorstep? It is time for Southern California to start depending on technology water and leaving service and underground water to the residents and farmers of Northern California where it belongs. Our career politicians are risking 1.2 million agriculture jobs by taking away service supplies and putting restriction on underground water which farmers have to drill over 180 feet to reach the water and still farms only 60% of their land and by 2020 will farm only 30 to 35% of their land. If the water doesn't flow, the food will not grow. That's why our farms are turning to deserts and soon will lead to fracking because of the career politicians. I will use the service water from lakes and rivers and underground water for the people and for the farms and not let it flow into the ocean. I will ban fracking statewide and complete the state water project.